What's going on, Western? My name's Chrissy Herbert. I'm here for BPC, and I'm so excited to be here at the London Music Hall with Il Scarlet. How are you guys doing tonight? Excellent. Thank yeah. you. Western, eh? Yeah, Western. Purple Spurs, yeah. Yeah, Purple Spurs. All right, yeah. We, we played one of their parties once, remember? Oh, yeah. Up in Collingwood? Oh, yeah, oh, yeah. <laughs> we played a party, and uh, because of all the commotion, mm -hmm. the ceiling cracked. The floor actually cracked, but the ceiling on the ceiling on the, the, we the oh, okay, house. yeah, okay. Yeah. Caved in a little there. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> Purple Spurs. Purple Spurs. <laughs> Woo! Woo! How are you guys feeling about tonight's show? Pumped. Yeah. 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 Good. The crowd's filling out nicely. You guys are here. That'll be fun. What's the set list gonna be like tonight? Well, we'll play some old songs, play some new songs. A couple covers. Yeah. Yep, a whole bunch of... We, we have a whole bunch of new stuff. We have a new CD coming out in 20... This year? This year, yeah. It's yeah. Time. So you know, we have a bunch of new songs in spring, so we're going to play a few of those. But of course, the old songs that everyone likes. That's exciting. So we have that to look forward to. So you guys are all from Ontario. Do you prefer playing on home turf versus far away? Far away is nice, especially... Especially when you bring responsibility. That's yeah. for sure. You know when you when you don't have a, all your friends coming out and everything, it's it, it's different. You don't have to worry about much during the show. Whereas like, like I said, local town show is like a lot of friends coming out. You want to make sure everybody has a good time. Still not that big of a problem, but yeah, a little different. Yeah, definitely. So CJ, yes. you joined the band just recently on January first. How has it been so far for you? So far, this experience has been actually a really good time. Uh, these guys make me feel nice and comfortable. I got through the band kind of knowing Justin in the past. We used to grow up together in Mississauga, but so far it's been one hell of a ride and uh, just want to keep it rolling. Got a whole show under his belt. Yeah. <laughs> hell of a ride. <laughs> but I'm sure it was a hell of a show, so. Yeah. yeah, so you guys have a pretty unique sound. I'm wondering if we can talk a little bit about where that's rooted from, if you guys have some inspiration. Yeah, it's, uh, I mean, we started out listening to a lot of, uh, Actually, uh, Il Scarlet sound, I guess, is rooted from Sublime, you know, I would say, yes. We grew up listening to a lot of mu music, especially from our parents and stuff like that, so we have an appreciation for the oldies and the classic rock. Um, but in high school, when, when we really started, you know, playing uh, punk rock and then, uh, you know, Sublime came along, I think, I think since then, uh, our musical tastes as well as our musical style has evolved, uh, that we do all sorts of different stuff now. I mean, there's little hip-hop things that we do and uh, you know with different producers and bands that we work with we've adopted new sounds so yes our first stuff we were big sublime wannabes but I think I think now we've kind of defined our own little little genre that see how good he is at this stuff <laughs> <laughs> um, so you guys were sort of first put on the scene back in 2004 at the Warp Tour. I'm wondering if we can talk a little bit about that, how you guys sort of got your break. Yeah, well, we could talk about that, Alex. Sure. <laughs> <laughs> so what he was trying to say is in 2004, we uh, set up a generator at the Vans Warp Tour in Barry Mopark, and uh, Kevin Lyman, the guy who runs the show, saw us playing. He liked us, and he invited us back to play at his barbecue that he does every year in Toronto. And uh, we just played probably two hours, which was incredible for back then, because we didn't. We were a, a baby band. We didn't have that many songs. I don't think we could. I don't even think today we can play yeah. two hours, or we'd really want to. Come up to the microphone. <laughs> play another one. Like, yeah, yeah, but <laughs> it, it worked, and he put us on the Warp Tour the year after, and uh, we did the full Warp Tour in 08. Is that 08? No, 011. Oh, 011. Yeah, 2011. 2011. Yeah, yeah. So th that was our first full Warp Tour. Was 2011. So that was 45 dates in 54 days. That must have been quite a ride for you guys. Most awesome, worst thing I've ever done. Yeah, it, it was awesome. It was my favorite time. It was definitely like hard at times, but worst. it was great. Yeah. Loved it. Well, thank you guys so much. I'm super excited to see the show tonight. Here's some new music. Here's some fan favorites. What's one of your fan favorites? Sorry? What's one of your fan favorites? Uh, probably nothing special. I feel yeah, like that was that's, yeah, that's, that's a good that's a good one. Yeah. Well, yeah. Yeah. Yeah, 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 yeah. Okay. Well, thank you guys so much. This has been Chrissy Herbert for BPC. We'll see you guys next time.
fantastic. I'd like to do this again. Good night, Rose Scott. Thank you.